All right, so I just want to say that I was really impressed by all of you. Um, this is my, I just finished my, well, my first year as a judge. I think I was started on February 13th, so that will be tomorrow is my first year. So previously I sat over there and I was an attorney judge. And I can tell you of all the years I've been involved in doing this, this is probably uh, the first year I'm glad I'm not there because they have a real difficult decision. It was a real close competition. Everyone did a great job. And I can tell you that most of you were more prepared and uh, than a lot of the people that appear in front of me. Don't look around, none of them are in here today. <laughs> I, I was just really impressed, and I can't imagine how hard all of you uh, have worked to get here. Uh, it's, it's apparent that you worked really, really hard. So I just want to uh, congratulate all of you for the for a job well done. Thank you. Thank you. Any any comments from the attorney judges? Sure. This is my sixth year of uh, judging this competition. Uh, every year, it's, it's gotten more and more pleasurable uh, to see each and every one of you participate in this program. Um, this year, by far, has uh, stood out to me uh, in terms of the past six years. I'm a prosecutor. I, I, on Monday, I was uh, sitting over there uh, doing my thing, and then uh, tomorrow, I'm back over there doing this in front of Judge, uh, Judge Markham. And this is, you know, it's very impressive just walking through the door. Uh, speaks volumes about each and every one of you being able to uh, successfully answer questions of the judge and of co-counsel and the witnesses, etc. Uh, very cool. So congratulations, each and every one of you. Stand up. I know you like public speaking. Yeah, I love it. He was sworn in on the night. On the night. See, I, was, I was sworn in on the night, but I started on the night. Oh, okay. See, Danny's got photos of you on his phone. <laughs> <laughs> you, guys, you guys can come watch the stock and cry. <laughs> My name is Miriam Modi. I'm president of the local bar association. We're recruiting attorneys for Lake County, so please feel free to come back after you finish law school. Um, you did a great job. It was really, I have scored in the past um, for the um, different scrimmages. I haven't actually done the final competition before, I don't that I remember. But you guys did an excellent job. Um, I was very impressed. Both teams were right on. The witnesses were really hilarious. We loved it. And I mean, <laughs> you did a good job. It was very solid. You knew your facts and you knew what was going on. And thank you for participating in the program. Hi, I'm Megan Langford. I'm a local attorney also. Um, and I was a prosecutor for 10 years uh, before I switched. And man, you guys, both teams on prosecution did a great job. Um, I was rooting for you a little bit when you were both on prosecution, but I have to say I, I disagree with Judge Markham. I would have 995 that forced me to do in a second. That's <laughs> so big. Um, but everyone did a really good job. You did a great job with your arguments. Um, the one piece of advice I would give both teams is when a judge sustains an objection, it doesn't mean you can't get that information from the witness. It just means you have to figure out another way of getting at it. And a couple of you particularly did a really good job of not being baffled by that objection and, and of going in and kind of finding another way to get at that information. So I would say that to prepare yourselves when you have a piece of information that you know someone's going to object to, like it's hearsay or something like that, figure out a couple ways to get at it because that way you won't have to sort of be stuck and confused on the spot. Um, but overall, yeah, I, I hope that a couple of you at least pursue careers in the law because you did a really good job. and and better than some attorneys who actually have licenses to practice <laughs> that I've seen. So very, very, job very well done. And I've been scoring these since the very beginning of the competition. So good job. <laughs> uh, any comments by the coaches? I just want to point out, Mary Lodio is head of the local bar association. And she instigated the sponsorship of the annual trophy. So the Lake County Bar has provided that trophy that sits up next to Judge Mark and goes to the winner each year. That's, that's, that's judge, one of that trophy, huh? That's Judge I, I, only, I only see one name on it. <laughs> so far. Uh, any comments by the coaches? 
regarding the performance? <laughs> I thought both sides were much improved from last year. Uh, Middletown, I thought you guys improved a lot from last year. And, and that's saying a lot because you guys were pretty good last year, too. <laughs> I'll just point out quickly, I've had two students uh, who are children of mine go through the program for four years. And there are uh, some members that I've just watched from the Upper Lake team over the last seven years. And to see the level of growth for these students starting out as freshmen, through their senior years is spectacular and one of the reasons why I continue to coach every year because it is amazing to see that growth and the places that it takes them as I see students of mine that have gone through the mock trial program who are now on their way into law school and moving forward and taking this as their launching pad forward. It's a very important program and I appreciate all the support that the program gets from not only the bench but the legal community as well. <laughs> I just want to make sure that uh, all of our wonderful volunteers this morning are, are uh, planning on staying for the award ceremony. Is that correct? I'm, I'm going to stay, and then afterwards, if anyone wants to talk to me, I'll be up here to act answer any questions or provide okay. any information. Great. Well, if, um, if anyone is planning on running away, let me just say, um, yes, huge thanks to the Lake County Bar Association, not only for sponsoring the trophy, but also for providing a donation for the winning team this year to help with trip costs to the state. So thank you very, very much for that. And also, um, I don't believe they have representation here today, but the Lake County Friends of Mendocino College. Oh, thank you. Yes. <laughs> the time of our volunteers and the financial resources of our community partners. So thank you all very, very much. And like you do. So I think it's going to be probably another five or ten minutes. We have to go see the artists. <laughs> so I'm gonna get off the bench and then I'll see you after. So during the week, in closing session, I want to go to the
my vantage point. Melissa, we really could not do this without all of the man hours that she puts into this project. So we really appreciate your time. All right, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to do the participation awards for all of the teammates. So first we're going to do, um, <clears throat> excuse me, team 14. Um, I think, right? Yeah. Oh boy, I'm going to Butcher these names. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Bolonic. 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 Yeah, you, I knew it. No, we're 24. I'm sorry, that's 24. I'm sorry, I, I meant I meant that. <laughs> oh my god. And I don't know, do you want them to stay up here, Alex, so you can take a photo? That would be good to get another. Okay. Yeah, stay up there, Bolonic. Oh, <laughs> 
God. My hands off too skin. Let's get off. I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm only looking at one of those cameras. I know, I know. I'm like seven of them with the camera. Thank you. I just like look at it. I'm just like, Waiting for the final, huh? Prosecution witness is 
Hugo Ramos. autograph now. <laughs> All right, moving to outstanding defense attorney, Dimitri Imbernetti. Amazing opponents. Yeah. The only reason we feel this good is because of you guys. Thanks. Thank you. You guys. <laughs> Let's go back to it right here. <laughs> 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 